a council leader who called for rough sleepers to be cleared in Windsor ahead of the royal wedding has survived a vote of no confidence. Conservative Simon Dudley said beggars could present the town in a sadly unfavorable light when Prince Harry marries American actress Meghan Markle in May. In his letter to police, he complained about aggressive begging and intimidation, and bags and detritus on the streets. It sparked a widespread backlash as well as criticism from Theresa May. But at a meeting of Victoria-led Windsor and Maidenhead Council on Monday, councillors defeated a motion accusing Mr Dudley of bringing the authority into disrepute by 43 votes to 9. Mr Dudley had told the meeting, I categorically disagree with the motion. I think it's driven by personal issues from some individuals which are long-standing and well-known by this council. Tory councillors quit a mid-row over rough sleepers and royal wedding. Mr Dudley had urged police to use their powers under the 1824 Vagrancy Act and the Antisocial Behaviour, Crime and Policing Act 2014 to protect residents and tourists. Last week he survived an attempt within his own Conservative group to oust him. Three councillors, Paul Brimelcombe, ASGHAR Majid and Jeffrey Hill, quit the party group in protest after last week's failed vote, choosing to continue as independent Conservatives. Councillors in the Royal Borough of Windsor and Maidenhead were summoned to the Monday evening, where it heard public questions and a motion of no confidence. Mr Majid told the council meeting that Mr Dudley's comments were embarrassing the royal family, the Prime Minister, the borough, our residents, members, officers, the list goes on and on and on. Can it be any worse than this in reputational terms? Councillor Dudley has once again shown a complete lack of capacity to deal with sensitive issues. After making the controversial comments, Mr Dudley apologised and said he was not referring to genuine homeless people, and that he regretted referring to Harry and Ms Markle's wedding at the time. The couple will marry at St George's Chapel, Windsor Castle, on May 19. Protesters had gathered outside Maidenhead Town Hall before the meeting, with Angus Cameron, chairman of the Windsor Labour Party, telling the Press Association Mr Dudley's views had been scandalous and very Trumpite. 